Hello and welcome back to Galeblade News. In today's news we'll be looking at um, the reduction in and the watering down of a law that requires uh, Brazil's population to wear face masks. Brazil's president uh, Jair Bolsonaro has sanctioned a law making the use of masks in public obligatory during the coronavirus pandemic. However, he has vetoed their use in shops, churches and schools. In a social media broadcast, Mr. Bolsonaro said people could have been fined for not wearing a mask at home. He has refused to acknowledge the gravity of Brazil's COVID-19 outbreak, despite it having the world's second highest numbers of cases and deaths. The virus has infected almost 1.5 million people and killed 61,884 there since late February, according to data collected by John Hopkins University. Uh, BBC South America correspondent Katie Watson says Jair Borsellino, Borsellino has never cared much for masks, a health recommendation that has become highly politicised as much of the handling of the coronavirus crisis in Brazil, even where mask use has been made obligatory. Not everyone has observed the rules and enforcement is often pretty lax, our correspondent adds. The bill passed by the Chamber of Deputies included an article saying that masks had to be worn by people in commercial and industrial establishments, religious temples, teaching premises and also closed places where people are gathering. On Friday, Mr. Bolsonaro vetoed the article, arguing that it could lead to the violation of property rights. He also vetoed another requiring the distribution of masks to the poor. Congress has 30 days to overrule the vetoes by absolute majority vote. So what do you think of the uh, situation with uh, Bolsonaro? Uh, do you think he's been incredibly arrogant in his response? After all, having the second highest number of deaths means that he's not properly taken care of his, um, well, his people. The other issue is, of course, without um, handing... Uh, Brazil is one of those areas where you do have rich areas and you have some of these very shanty based towns, kind of like the slums, and there's a lot of violence and confusion in those areas. Um, so people can't afford the masks. Um, what, whatever you think, leave your comments down below, like the video if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe.